do a week in my life college vlog this week. I'm just going to bring you along with me day to day and just show you, you know, the big pieces of my day and show you what it's like as a college student at VSU. I personally am a psychology major. Hey crazy. How are you? You waiting? You waiting for your dad? So vlogging kind of flopped today. I just dropped Monk off with his dad. And I'm gonna go home now, but um I had to rush everywhere I went today. So in between classes I hung out with seven and then after my last class I had to do some stats homework and I still need to do stats homework and <laughs> I picked up Monk and had a job interview at the place I picked him up from. So hopefully, fingers crossed that goes well. I'm not going to quit my job that I have now. I just need a second job for a little more income while I'm in college. It's perfect. It's every other weekend and holidays. So I'll talk to you more once I'm home, but I wanted to explain why today kind of flopped with the vlog. And I'm hoping that the rest of this week goes a little bit better. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go get some breakfast. Uh, probably gonna go to Einstein's and then head over to class. I have like 45 minutes, so I'll have time. And that way, I won't be hungry when I go to the gym and I don't have time to like digest my food. And then after my two classes, I'll go to the library for an hour, then go to the gym for 30 minutes, then go to work. So, see you in the next clip. So the last clip you saw, I was in the dining hall with Connor. I left my uh, school card uh, home today. So when I told you that I was gonna go to Einstein's, when I got to Einstein's, I realized I didn't have my wallet or my school card, so I couldn't pay for it. So my class ended at 1.45 today, so I met Connor at our dining hall, and he swiped me in, thankfully. And uh, we stayed there, ate, did some homework, which you saw. And now I just walked Allie, which she hated because it's raining outside. It's been such a miserable, dreary day, and I have about 30 minutes until I need to go to work, so I'm just going to decompress for a little while because I've been on the go non-stop, and I'm pretty much going to be on the go at work non-stop until I come home. I'll be home around 7.30 tonight, 8, something like that, and then um, tomorrow is my off day. I don't have anything besides school to do tomorrow, so I'll probably have a better vlog clip for tomorrow, but if you're enjoying the vlog so far, thank you for watching, and give it a thumbs up. So I figured I'd take you through my night routine really quickly. Um, I want to have a whole separate video on my night routine, but uh, this is just me a quick version because I haven't filmed a lot the past few days, past two days. So I wanted to get a little more extra content and you know talk with you guys about my day and this week so far. So this has been a good week so far. Yesterday was Monday. 
and um, I had a job interview after class and I got a dog sat for one of my old professors and uh, that went well. I think the interview went well. I'll know on Friday if I got the job or not. Get my hairbrush. So, just for something different, I haven't straightened my hair in like two years because it just takes so long. But uh, it was it was a fun change. I like to brush through all the tangles. That way it's easier to shampoo and condition. I want to put a little bit of argan oil in my hair before I wash it, just on the ends. This is the argan oil I use, so I need to tone my hair. It's very yellow at the top. And I wash my face and everything in the shower, so I'll come back to you once I'm out of the shower. So I'm out of the shower now, I ate dinner, and now I'm about to have a snack. And then I'll probably go to bed around 9.30, 8.37 now. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos and hang out with Allie and just relax. I'm not going to do any more homework. I did homework before work and a little bit at work while I could. And my brain is just fried, so I'm going to take a rest. <laughs> tomorrow I'm going to get back and do a lot more homework because I don't have to work tomorrow. It's my only day off. So I'm going to spend it doing a good bit of homework. Uh, and you'll probably see that. I'm gonna go to the library and chill out and go to the gym. I'm gonna try to film a little bit at the gym, but I, if, I feel weird about it because I'm not the only one there, you know, and I don't wanna get anybody in the shot in case they're insecure about how they work out, if they're new to the gym or they just don't want that to be plastered on YouTube for the whole world to see. So I'm trying to be courteous of other people and, and show you guys to the best of my ability, but sometimes it just isn't possible. So, uh, with that being said, if I don't show you, I am probably going to train full body tomorrow. Uh, I don't really want to train any specific muscle group because uh, I'm just trying to get back in the swing of things. I fell off the gym for a little while, unfortunately. So I'm just trying to, you know, get, get my bearings again and just, just go. I'm probably going to do uh, more core focused and uh, body weight focused. So, uh... I worked on my running yesterday, I'm going to give my shins a break today because if I run every day I've noticed that I start to, I start to struggle with shin splints until I figure out uh, how to fix that I, I'm going to run every other day and not every day. So with that being said I'm going to end the vlog here for today and pick it up tomorrow morning. If you're enjoying the vlog so far, I'm glad, thank you for watching, maybe leave a thumbs up, I don't know, Good night. The trajectory has been vivid and it's just full steam ahead. Whoa, a lot of questions, guys. So I'm running super late this morning. I left about five to 10 minutes too late. I normally leave 30 minutes before I need to be in class, but I got carried away this morning. So I'm about to have to uh, speed walk across campus to Converse Hall um, after, because I have abnormal psych and then psych statistics. And then I'll go to the library and I'll update you once I'm in the library and have lunch or something like that. So I just got back from the gym. Uh, it was shock. It was shoulder and arm day and uh, I did a little run afterwards. Hello. So I just got back from the gym. I brought my stuff upstairs and now I'm walking alley. Today was shoulder and arm day and I did a little run afterwards. It wasn't anything really long or anything just to get some cardio in because I wore my Converse into the gym so I, so I could like, you know, have a flat surface or whatever because I thought I was going to do legs and I didn't. But um, I had my running shoes in my car, so I figured I might as well go for a run, get some cardio in, because like I said, I want to do uh, runs every other day, and do one on Monday, today's Wednesday, so I'm walking Allie, I'm going to try to let her go off leash for a little while until we see another dog, because I do live in a small apartment, so I do try to let her, you know, run around as much as possible when there's not other dogs around, because she's not very friend friendly with other dogs, so, um, yeah, after we go back upstairs, 
I'm gonna try to write my abnormal psych paper. Today I finished a uh, online homework assignment, went to all my classes, and turned in all my stats homework. It was 12 pages long, and we have an exam on Friday, so I need to study for that. But yeah, today overall has been a pretty good day. Very thankful. didn't really you know style it much so that's on me um, <laughs> good morning vlog so I'm about to go try to make a deposit on a tattoo I say try because my tattoo artist had an opening this Saturday and he posted on his Instagram and it's between me and another person so he's gonna see if he has time for both of us but if he doesn't whoever gets there first is you know first come first serve so I'm gonna go try to make this deposit and I'll let you know what happens if I don't if I don't get the slot, it's not the biggest of deals. I I just have the money right now, and it's he had a he had an opening, and all his Saturdays are booked up for months. So this will be a great opportunity because I really want to get my uh, I can't show you now because I'm wearing two long sleeves. I want to get a uh, cover up on my tattoo that I have on my bicep right now, and I'll talk to you probably either when I'm parked about to walk to the shop or after class. So, so I just finished at the tattoo shop. Saturday was already booked because he's working on somebody's sleeve, so I totally understand. I, I did tell him that if he couldn't fit me in, then it's totally fine because it was so last minute. So I made an appointment for March 20th at four o'clock. Mail him my inspiration piece and what I need to get covered up. I'm home. Uh, I tried to go to class today and uh, I got hit with this wave of anxiety so uh, I came home and uh, I'm just gonna try to relax for a little while. I got hungry so I had some uh, vegan chicken nuggets and I'm just gonna spend uh, until I have to go to work the rest of the day relaxing with Allie or trying to relax. Uh, I think this is just a buildup of uh, everything that's happened in January. A lot in my personal life has happened in January with my family situation. So uh, I think this is just a buildup of all of that, trying to find a second job, uh, stuff with my dad, stuff with my mom that I don't really want to share on the internet or make public. So... I'm gonna do my best to not really dwell on a lot of things. The only homework that I really need to get done is uh, writing a paper, which is easy for me, and I'll do that after I put the kids to bed at work. So, uh, I don't really know what else to say or how to end this clip, but this is, uh, I felt like I should record because I know I'm not the only person that uh, has anxiety. And this isn't as regular for me as it used to be. I've gotten a lot better about managing uh, my stress. It's just uh, this month threw a lot at me. So I'm gonna give myself a mental health day. Good morning and happy Friday. I'm running late for class. So I'm gonna end this clip really really quick right here and I'll pick it up probably after class my mom is coming into town today so I don't know if she's gonna be in the vlog or not she doesn't really like to be on camera but we'll see we have to run a couple errands in town once I'm out of class and I'll try to keep you updated as much as possible but happy Friday happy end of the vlog and I hope you had a good week and thank you for watching okay so I was trying to wait to listen to medicate until I could react to it and like bore you guys but I couldn't stand it anymore, so I'm driving to class right now, and I won't have time until later today after I meet with mom. So I'm gonna listen to it now. I already started it, and you guys, let's just let's just appreciate. Buzzing by in this life, been a while. Thought that you forgot, but that's all right. Have you been glad to hear it? Take a pill.
Melting of the pain Change the chemicals inside my brain I worry I won't be the same I've literally felt this like what she's feeling like my these reactions are so genuine because I understand that grief that pain that heartache of I just want it to stop I just want it to go away I just want something in order for me to feel better and oh my god this is this isn't in, in case you haven't listened to any of her uh, other music this is pretty different like a pretty different sound to her other you know singles or whatever and I'm here for it. Honestly, this is, honestly, <laughs> this is, this is really good. I am thoroughly impressed. Okay, unpause. I like this beat too. I like that. I'm here for this. So that's the end of it. I'm gonna give like a better reaction once like I'm stopped. So the lighting is gonna be a little different because I am in the parking garage now, but oh my God, that was so good. So um, yeah, like I said, it's pretty different from her other music. I like the beat of this. I like the message behind it. Cause I've been in the, like I've been in her shoes. I'm sure a lot of people have as well, where you just like, I want this feeling to stop, but I don't, when I change my brain chemistry because like if you've ever had to take like antidepressants or anti-anxiety medication you know it's a lot of trial and error you know it's a lot of taking different ones to figure out which one works for you because not everybody's brain chemistry is the same obviously there's no one cause for a mental illness there's no one cause for how you're feeling so it just it takes a lot of trial and error to see what fixes it and doctors do tend to over prescribe antidepressants like when I was on them that's not what I needed I needed to be on birth control because I was having a hormone issue which has been resolved since then but they are so quick to jump to medication when that's not always needed but I like how she said like she's not making it a taboo more than it already is in this song because genuinely people sometimes do need medication and there's nothing wrong with that but it's a lot it's a lot to take on when you do start medication because it is a lot of trial and error and messes with your brain chemistry and it's just a lot. I like this song, I like the beat, I like the message behind it. I love her vocals in this song. She's, I like the raspiness of her voice. People always comment on how like, she's trying too hard and it doesn't sound good. That's the kind of style that I enjoy personally because I grew up listening to emo music like she did listening to punk rock, listening to heavy metal, listening to screamo music. So if you don't like her raspy voice, you wouldn't like my kind of style of music anyways. Hi mom. You're so cute. Ooh. You're in the way of my chocolate. <laughs> so I'm with mom now. You saw the clip of us in Cheddar's. Uh, we went to Target and we went to Best Buy. And now we're gonna go to the farmer's market. We're just running errands. She had stuff to do in Valdosta. And then after the farmer's market, we're gonna say our goodbyes. And then I'm gonna go home, walk alley, and probably go to Seven's house. So I don't know how much I'm gonna update you the rest of the day. I don't know if I'm just gonna end the vlog soon. But that's what's been going on. That's what I have planned for today. Hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching. So I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you for coming along with me with my week in my life. Um, I thought about doing another one this week, but I think I'm going to take a break from that and just do a regular uh, film edit upload instead of doing a periodic week in my life. I may do a college day in my life sometime this week, but I just wanted to give a closure to this video. Uh, last week was a pretty good week. Um, I made a tattoo appointment. I got a new job. I got to see mom. So it was a pretty good week. So thank you for coming along with me. I hope you enjoyed and thank you for watching.